how to create sign up forms for your Shopify store in Clavio. Hello everyone, welcome back to another video. In this video, we're going to be talking about sign up forms and how you can create sign up forms for your Shopify store using an app called Clavio. Okay, and this is going to be a really easy and really fun tutorial. So please do make sure to fully watch this video till the end to get the whole idea and full gist of how we're going to do this. So without further ado, let's get straight into it. Now, to start things off, what we are going to be doing is we're going to go ahead into our apps and we're going to actually add Clavio, right? Because without Clavio, this will not work. So we're going to go into all recommended apps and go into Shopify App Store. Now, once you go over here, we're just going to wait for things to load up. And uh, once things load up over here, basically, it's going to give us these apps over here, right? Now you could simply come here, click on apps and we can write Clavio. And once you write Clavio, it gives you all the different app providers that you have for Clavio. And uh, obviously you can go ahead and uh, choose whatever app works best for you. So there's Clavio for email marketing and SMS. There's Clavio for reviews and a whole lot more. And obviously we want to create sign up forms. So the email marketing one would make more sense, right? So we're going to click on install. And this is going to install Clavio for emails for us. And obviously it helps us start our email marketing journey in great style. Now, when it comes to actually, you know, starting your email marketing journey on this, you can simply click on install app. And once you click on install app, it's going to load things up for you. And as your app gets installed, what you're going to simply do over here, it says create your Clavio account to connect to Shopify. So you're going to add your email and stuff, and then you're going to add your password. So once you add your password, this is obviously to create your account, add in your company name, your company website, add in your phone number and all. And once you do that, you're going to choose I'm not a robot and click on get started. Okay. And uh, your company website must be a proper valid URL. So obviously just go ahead and add your Shopify's URL because we're going to connect it to your Shopify account, right? So just come here and it's going to give us our Shopify URL. We're going to copy this Shopify URL, come here and we're going to click on paste. And once you do that, click on get started. And from here on out, you're going to be set with Clavio. Now from here, it's going to take you to the creation of different forms for yourself. And obviously when it uh, comes to creation of forms, there's different uh, email sign up forms that you can make for yourself. And they're pretty incredible to make. So let's just wait for it to connect to our Shopify. So here you have it. Sync your data between Clavio and Shopify. So obviously we're going to do that to connect the integration and start the actual integration. So once we do this, it's going to ask us our address line and stuff. So just make sure to add all those Add in your state or province. And once you do that, click on continue, add your sender information. So add in your sender's email address, which you're going to be using to send obviously, right? So just add the necessary sender's email. Obviously it could be the same as your Shopify. Okay. It doesn't matter. So do that and uh, click on continue. So how do you want to reach your subscribers? SMS is currently only available in the United States, Canada, United Kingdom, Australia, New Zealand, and Ireland. So you get three options, email only, SMS only, email and SMS. So go with any one of these. In our case, email only would make sense because it's a sign up form and a sign up form would make more sense on your emails. So just go ahead and confirm that you're not a robot or anything through your email verification. So click on confirm uh, email once you get the verification email and it's going to take you through the onboarding. Now I have uh, selected my email and everything and I'm going to show you what the dashboard looks like. So this is your basic dashboard on Clavio and you can start working with this. So you says set up your account. So first of all, it says connect to Shopify, which we've already connected, you know, because we added the app directly from Shopify. So, you know, we're already set with that. Then it says turn on website tracking. So you can turn that on right now or you can skip that later. OK, and I'm going to skip it for now because it doesn't really matter. Then it's importing your contacts. Now you can import your contacts manually or you can actually add a, uh, you know, proper XLSX or maybe an Excel sheet. So once we add those things, you're simply going to go into your campaign section 
and you can create campaigns over here as well for your BCFM or your Shopify orders. But we're here to create a form. So for that, we're going to come to sign up form simply. And uh, we're going to click on that. And here it's going to start giving us all these different types of forms that we can work with. So here it says multi-step email and SMS. So uh, you can go ahead and browse templates, add different things. And there's different types of templates that you can work with. Just go with whatever template you think looks best and start creating with that. So in my opinion, this one looks more professional. So I'm going to go with that, give it a name. And uh, you can see that it's desktop only and it's a full page sign up form. So keep those things in mind. I personally go, I don't like a full page one. So I'm going to keep it a pop up. First order discount, choose an email subscriber list if you have any. I'm going to go with the preview list for now, which is a, a custom list that they give us. And you're going to click and create form. Now it takes you into, you know, actually editing the things in the form and all. So let's just go ahead and do that. And uh, once you obviously customize your form, everything should be good to go. You're going to go in styles, you have pop up, full page, fly out. You can also add embedded things. You have side images, you know, left image, right image and all. And uh, there's form backgrounds, there's form styles, there's text styles. There, you can input different field styles for yourself if you want to. So these are your basic uh, editorial or customizing options, basically. To just go with whatever seems best for you. And once you've gone with that, you also have your targeting and behavior. And uh, once you go with the necessary targeting and behavior and uh, you've set all the relevant details for yourself, you should be good to go. So once you've done all of this, you can uh, add steps to this if you want to. These steps could be, you know, profile information or SMS steps. And once you've, you know, actually edited everything about your form, you should just click on publish. And uh, yeah, that's going to publish your form to your Shopify page. Now. To add this form into your Shopify page, we're going to come to our Shopify over here. So once you're over here, again, go on apps. It's going to give you your Clavio marketing app over here. I'm just going to open that up. I'm going to close this section over here because it's saved everything. And here to add the app into your online store, just come to online store, click on customize and add the Clavio widgets into your store and you should be good to go. So yeah, that's the general idea of how you are going to create signup forms using Clavio. So I hope this tutorial was extremely helpful to you. And uh, if you need any more videos like this, please do tell me I am always available and I will give you the easiest step to step guides for any type of videos that you demand. And uh, if you have any queries regarding this video, you can let me know down in the comments. And uh, yeah, I guess I'll see you next time. Before signing off, please like and subscribe to the channel and uh, leave down a nice comment if you watch the video. And please don't forget to share this video with uh, any of your friends in need or your family. And uh, I hope you all have a great day. So until next time, I'll see you later and goodbye.